Hello everyone. I have some more stuff to show you for diamond painting. This is going to be some really interesting diamond paintings that I have ordered and things. So stick with me to see what I have. This one comes through Amazon, and I'm wondering, since this is all in this, and I did peek, the, it is from China. So that lets me know that some of my, I must have ordered a few from AliExpress. I can't even, I can't even remember what I ordered. So now I have, because you have to wait so long from buying something from AliExpress, I'm having to try to figure out, oh yes, oh yes, I know exactly what these are. Um, these are really cute. But before I do that, I want to open up the one I got from Amazon. I've had it about a week. I did look in it, but I have not opened it up at all. But um, this one, let me see, um, it's another sweet Mandalorian, the child, is what this one is. And I went ahead and got it when I was ordering something else for the RV, because I thought it was just so cute. I just thought the colors was just really cute. So that's what that one looks like. I'll let you see it up close, the grid. And the colors right here. I am not using my extra camera. That's why I'm darker on this side of my face. Okay, I'm gonna put this big one down here for right now. You can tell I get it, get the uh, when I get stuff from um, AliExpress, the canvases are a lot bigger than the ones that I get from Amazon. So I recommend if you're going to get anything from Amazon in in diamond paintings, make sure it's an up close picture. See how that one is pretty much an up close picture of his face. It blows his face up enough large enough to where each individual square color diamond has a chance to get in there and, and give you a little bit of depth and shading and things. I had someone ask on my YouTube, one of my other YouTube videos, why I said that the Christmas scene in one of the set of four seasonals would be hard to see and be pixelated and I had to explain that to this uh, you know to them that if it's something big like a, a, a scenery a landscape and you have horses you have people you have all kinds of things in there they're just gonna be look they're they're not gonna be very detailed like right here it's wonderful that this is up close okay she would even be better if I had gotten her in a bigger canvas size. Because then this, there's supposed to be people right here. Okay? So you're not really able to see those people right there. Okay? It probably comes across better to you on the camera than in real life. Because I'm up close to it. And the camera is going to perceive it like you're further away. But you can still see this is a guy. He's got a feather cap, cap uh, hat. Is he a Robin Hood? And this is the princess. Is she reading a book about Robin Hood or something? I don't know. It could be any kind of uh, book that she has read and she's fell asleep and she's dreaming it. But if you can understand, the, the reason I show you is because this right here needed to be bigger so these little squares could get in there and really show you some depth and some shading 
that's how you see your hand in front of this is because your hand is lighter and your shading light and shading values is what brings things out in a 3d effect so now that we've got this Grogu he has 25 colors and I'm going to go ahead and show you this. This is uh, 21 through 25. And there's some pretty colors in this. And I, again, I don't have my, I did not set up my other light. It seems to really get it too bright in here, but I don't know. Maybe I'm going to see how it does. And if I have to get a different light, I'll get a different light. But just letting you see all the different colors. This this one has such a wonderful wide range of colors in it. It's an actual very pretty picture. Even though it is a little alien um, being on the Mandalorian. But the colors are just so pretty. It did come with a larger square boat, and it does have the opening to pour it. It came with a gripper. Um, it also came with the tweezers and a, a spacer um, and some baggies is in there. The reason I... I I don't know if I'm using the right lingo here for this. Spacer. And the reason I say that, it's not to put down, but to separate and straight. It's a straightener is what it is. That's what I should be calling it, a straightener. It's a wide straightener to try to keep your diamonds straight in their lines. This is a round. When you're putting these back in, make sure that you put it in a way that you can see what your little picture is. <laughs> Anyways, here we go with our... Did I mention I didn't have my scissors? Let me get my scissors. <laughs> I had ordered some more from Amazon that have not come in yet. This is, uh, that order is the first order that I've, that I've actually ordered diamond paintings from Amazon that did not get here within two to three days. That lets me know that this could, that company, when that gets here, I'll let y'all know which one it is. I'm not gonna spoil what the theme of that order is. Somebody might be able to guess it by some of one of the other things that I just did. But I'm not going to say anything else than that. They really, 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 really packed their bags. Now, this is really strange. I have never gotten diamond paintings just in these in a plastic bag and not in a box. I'm usually getting, they usually pack the big ones in boxes. I hope that this is not all wrinkled up because I'm so excited for this one. You're going to love this. Let me move up a little bit on my little chair. Now I'm going to open it up. Okay. Tape everywhere. Alright. I'm going to stab myself. Okay. Everybody's going to see me go to the hospital. And it did come with a little boat. A little, few little baggies in there. Um, the little white, it gave me two white pins. One with uh, probably a six spacer or more, and then a small spacer. I don't know if you can see that with it being blurry. 
Come on, camera, work with me. And then some wax. And I like these because they have little sparkles in them. And you know me with sparkles. That's why we do these paintings. Okay. The picture's on there, but I'm not going to show it. Not yet. Not yet. I'm going to put this down. Okay. i got to make room. Right. Now, the back of this does not look promising. Does it? It might flatten out okay. The front of it looks like this. All right. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. It's got a lot of wrinkles. Got a lot of wrinkles. <sighs> Sometimes it gets so frustrating. Why couldn't they just roll it up and put it in a box? A box. And then put the bubble wrap, that padding stuff. It, you know, that it looks like the padding that they put around horses' legs whenever they hurt their legs on the racetrack. That's what it looks like. Now, this is the bottom. I'm still going to make it mysterious. And it is wrinkled. But I think all these wrinkles will go away once I flatten it out. Because it, I don't see it in the glue. It's just mainly the canvas. And there's the bottom. Can you tell what that is? Huh? Can you tell what that is? I bet you can. It looks like a bicycle, doesn't it? All right. Now we'll show you the top. And see if I can get this thing to go down. Nice and neat. Okay, I think I did it. Oh, there's some air bubbles. Let's get these air bubbles out. Okay. Now we'll do the top. And I have to be careful. I was starting to pull it up. I was starting to get the corner. And the corner glue was going to come up with the corner of the cover. So make sure when you go to pull it up, you're actually getting just the cover and not the glue because this is not the poured glue. This is a double-sided tape, a big double-sided tape that they put down over top of the printing of your diamond painting. The grid is printed on canvas. Then they take the, the, the double-sided tape, this big white sheet right here, that's the backing to the tape, and they put it over the whole thing. To make it sticky. Now the the one you saw before with the clear top on it, the clear uh, paper, uh, the plastic on it, that is a poured glue where they pour the glue on there, get it flat, and then they put that plastic down on it. Now I have made sure that that glue is down. And I'm not pulling the glue up with the top. And here we go. Now you'll get to see what it is. If I can get a good hold of it. It is a little grandmother. Little lady. Holding her hat. And she's riding on the back of her grandson's. I'm just, ex I'm thinking it. It's a child. Uh. I'm thinking it's her grandson. Her, his bicycle. So, yeah. That is what this one is all about. I love this. There's a whole theme of these. Where this granny, grandmother, is all about getting into fun with the grandkids and the neighborhood kids. So, that is why I like this I found this set and I'll put it the links of it in the description remember they are Aliexpress and it will take about a month to get them a few weeks to get them I am surprised that they get them a little bit faster I may even put it on here when I ordered and when I got them I did get them today on the 7th of April so 
isn't that just the cutest thing? And I'll put up the picture right here of what it's supposed to look like when it, the, the actual picture. And I did get it in a 40 by 50 size, which is a pretty good size to get good detail in it. It does have a little bit of a far away somewhat, but it is kind of close enough to where you can get by without having to go over 60 um, centimeters. So it is a 40 by 50. Now remember, when you're going to calculate this two inches, you want to take the zero off. You see the 40 and the 50. Take the zero off and multiply that by 4. 4 times 4 is 16. 4 times 5 is 20. 16 by 20, if I'm correct. Okay. I think I'm correct. So there is that picture and the reason I love getting these from AliExpress, I know I have to wait, I, can't, I have more choice. I can get them in a larger picture, I have more choices of all kinds of different themes, all kinds of different subject matters, and they do come kind of all jumbled up in here not so much in, in, a, in a straight line like like the one like the little Yoda one not Yoda Gro, Grogu I'm sorry Grogu okay and the another reason why I like to get it from from these companies on AliExpress is because they'll come with an inventory sheet a really good the bigger pictures tend to come with an inventory sheet that is a sheet that has all of the colors, symbols, the uh, drill numbers, how many they sent in the pack, and this is the quantity that is needed of that color to do this picture. So what I do is I cut out this right here, these two right here. I am not going to go through all these, if you notice how these are loose, different sections, of, I mean, they're not all together, they're in, they're in like chunks, see, and so what I'm going to do, and they have their numbers on them, you can see where they have their numbers on them, if you can see it that number right there. I'm going to go through and I'm going to check them off on my inventory sheet. Once I do that, I'll know if they have left out anything or sent me the wrong amount and I'll be able to write it up here what numbers I do not have and I can contact the company on AliExpress and tell them which numbers I am missing. If they do not send them, I will leave a, a review that they do not send them. You can get them on Etsy, but they, mind you, they may be a little off. Some manufacturers are not the same on, you know, the colors can be off. So just know that. But we hope, we hope that uh, these will be um, all there, but I'm going to go ahead and go on to the next one Now I will check them all at the end and give an update on here The next one is this one Bags Now these are in boxes now the boxes can come crushed and sometimes it will affect the diamond painting, but sometimes it does. Most of the time it doesn't. Now, there have been some that people have gotten that have been in water. That's kind of weird. Okay, there's three in here. Yay! Three! Let's see. I had a different kind of thing going on with this one. 
with these, this whole order. I had several, I have a whole bunch in sitting in my cart on AliExpress, but I can't afford all of them. So whenever they have sales, I will go in there and recheck what the prices are. And if they come down, I try to get them under $16, under $15. These sizes, sometimes you can get them under that. So um, that's what I look for. Now this one, I'm going to go ahead and open up the damaged one. Let me put these over here. All right. Now this is the, the box that come in. Gemify. I don't know if that's the store. I'll put all the store information and where to get them in the description. If I forget anything that I say I'm going to put in the description, please comment and say, hey, you forgot this. And I'll be glad. Oh, I'll be glad to put you know fix it. Sometimes I forget from the time I edit to the time I go to put it on uh, YouTube. I forget what I said I was going to put on there. So <laughs> you can forget all. Oh my goodness! Wow, look what they gave! Wow, awesome! And then uh, one of these. Uh, the pen with a uh, four placer and or three placer one of those the wax is pretty substantial so bigger than a lot of course this is a bigger picture some of the the baggies okay and some tweezers so that is exactly what they they have sent in this. I'm just so tickled. They this is a straightener that they have sent. That's I can't hold on to anything. The straightener. I haven't seen one like that. See, I can't hold on to anything. Makes me wonder if I should go get tested for for anything that makes whatever what is it makes you drop everything all the time okay nothing else in the box now this one was a little crushed it doesn't look like it's crushed let's put that over there they've used the rubber bands on the edge now I have had issues where they've put rubber bands in the middle and it caused a crease in the picture and they've only put it in the edge. You can see that. In the edge. All right. And so now, even over here, see if when I move this, you're going to see a little bit of a crease in that. See how it creases? However, it's in the edge. It's just a little bit into the picture. You can see where the picture starts. And that can be seen. So. I don't like rubber bands and I have called and told some of the companies please don't use rubber bands just use some tape just to put on the outside to close it it'll be fine now this is the first time that I have gotten a big picture that is a poured glue and it did come with an inventory sheet and there's the picture that I got. It is a man and a woman at the beach with a child. Isn't that so pretty? That is so nice. And then there, you can see where they've checked it. Now they do, don't be fooled. They can check this. Check them off. That's how they're, they're filling the order. But I have went behind them and found that they did not get all of them in there. The little stamp that you see, the 11, that is the worker. That is how they'll know who filled this order whenever you report if they haven't put everything in there. You'll need that, you'll need that whenever you contact them. So this one has, let me see, I'm going to count them.
34. 34, pa 34 colors. And it, the round, it's round. This one I tried to get in square. But they did not have an option. And it comes on a foam. These little things. Let me tell you what to do with these. Now this one doesn't have the little holes in the center. But you can cut these in. This, cut these in like one inch little sections. And make you a hole in the middle. Put your ribbon down through there. And put glitter on it. On them. And you've got a little garland of marshmallows it looks like fake marshmallows so don't throw these away they look like teeny tiny pool noodles but don't throw these away this can be a garland of marshmallows glittery marshmallows okay good tip right there but here is the actual picture and it is close enough to where we're going to have a little bit of detail in the face you can see that with the pour glue, it always looks like it's wrinkled up. Okay? You see her, you can see the, the texture of her dress. This is just beautiful. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, I'm going to check the canvas. Let me move everything out of the way. My little grandson is actually having a little bit of um, headache and fever today. He threw up this morning. So we're watching him, trying to get, we're going to get the fever down. It's below grade. Not that bad. But he doesn't feel very well. He's over at my mom's, which is a great grandmother, which lives beside us. You hear me say mom all the time. That's where he's at. And I do see these rivers on I mean, I can see where the wrinkles were in the glue, but it's, I don't see that it's air pockets. No. And there's glitter in this canvas. So the canvas is, in a, is a really good quality canvas. Okay. And you can see that it's, it's not too bad. It is pretty sticky. Feels pretty sticky. I'm gonna turn it around so I can get this back on. And I'm gonna check this top part out. This is the first large picture that I've had with the poured glue. And I'm just, it's a 45 by 60. 45 by 60 centimeters. Woo! The static electricity. No, don't, don't, don't. Got to be very careful. Got to be very careful. I don't want it to stick to itself. That, I love this picture. I really, really love this picture. It's just so nice. So very nice. And I think you're all going to like this one, too. Now, it does feel pretty sticky. I am concerned that it is not as sticky as some of the others, but it just may be me being worried. Um, like the edge kind of felt a little less sticky. But I do have stuff to put on it if it isn't. If it loses some of the sticky or anything like that, I have stuff that I can put on it to fix it. But it's, I don't see any issue. It's just not quite as crazy sticky as some of them that I've got. It is sticky, though. I'm trying to just get this back on here as good as I can. Without, kind of, yeah, I try to let it lay down on its own. It kind of tends to do its own thing, but I can't get these wrinkles out. So, we shall try a little bit later. You can see how many wrinkles I put in it. 
<laughs> that's the only thing I hate about the 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 clear pour glue covering. But I kind I like the, I like it because I can see it as I'm working on it. But isn't that just the prettiest little girl? Okay. Again, here are all of the diamonds that come in with that. That's a lot of them. And they're all kind of, and I will have to go through and individually check them. And I'll do that in just a little while. Okay, we've got two more. Two more, two more, two, two, two more. So you can kind of get an idea, the feel, feel for what I'm going for in this. Okay. It come with the, the tweezers. They didn't shut the thing. It was the same company because they're given the same straightener, same baggies, same amount of wax, same boat. Same exact thing as the one before. Same company. This time, though, I do have a problem before I even open it up. And you can see what it is. The rubber band. Get those rubber bands off. Because look. And that will be seen in your picture. No matter how you try to, to save it, it will have those lines. But I'm glad they're on the ends. But this one, definitely I'm not happy with. Okay. So when I'm looking at it and showing it to you, you'll be able to see it. Now these are the, the numbers. Now these do not come with the marking of the serial number of your picture. So they must stay with the picture that you are doing. Or you write on the outside of it what it is. Because if you don't, and you put them in separate places you're not gonna know what this goes to that's the only difference between the aliexpress one i mean the yeah this aliexpress ones and the amazon ones like the smaller ones they usually have the the serial number on the 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 um diamonds the diamonds in these big companies because these have so many they literally go through and pick it out from a bunch of different stacks of diamond colors, you know, inventories. They're not produced on a machine for each individual can canvas. These are all in bins and they have to go out. They take that inventory sheet and they go and they pick them, front, pick the colors and put them in this, roll it up, and this is how we get it, okay? So, um, inventory sheet should be inside this. There it is. And here it is. Here is the picture. It is a lady sitting on the side of a creek or a little water area. I think it's a creek, or if you're from the North Carolina mountains, it's a branch. <laughs> and she has a light, and she's She's sitting there, enjoying, thinking, pondering, whatever. And there is the colors and the symbols that it's going to be. And again, the same person got these out and checked them. And I bet it has the same amount. Let's see. Thirty-three. This one has thirty-three colors in it. Again, this is the way it's going to look. I'm going to make sure that this stays around the diamonds. And now I'm going to spread this out and let you see what it looks like. And again, don't throw these away. You can make a whole garland for your Christmas tree to look like marshmallows. And here's the lady. 
I got to get her head in there. Okay. Let me see if I can get her in there. Good. Let's see. Maybe this way. I think this way will be better. What do you think? Yep. Much better. Isn't that nice? She's got her feet in the water. And it's big enough to see all the detail. Okay? Now, if I got this smaller, you could probably see it, but just her head or face wouldn't be quite as detailed. Okay? So, let me check the... And it's wanting to roll up on me, which is normal. And we will check to see if we can... Come on now. Remember, there's a right side and a wrong side on this plastic cover. And there is the... And it is sticky. It is not quite as sticky as some. But it is sticky. <laughs> Trying to let you see the surface of it. Okay. So I'm not going to unravel the top and run roll it yet. So I'm thinking that it, it looks fine. I don't see any really big issues. Really, I'll open up the corner. I don't see much of an issue. Um where the, you can see on the, let me put this back on there. You can see on the back where that rubber band was. Let me see if I can, now watch it disappear. I hope it does, I hope I'm wrong. I hope it does disappear. But no, it's right there, it's down the side. You can see it right there. Looks like a fish. <laughs> But hopefully it may just disappear. This is where it was really like the surface of it, closest to the rubber band. So at least they don't put it too far into the middle of the picture. Trying to see if I see it on that side. Not quite so bad. But, yep. Yeah. There's that one. And again, I will check the drill, the diamonds, in a, in a moment. Last box, right here. It's the only one, really, that doesn't look like it's had anything, any problems with it. Same company. And same rubber bands. Get those things off of there. Anyway, so let's go ahead and open this up. And we shall find the inventory sheet. And here's the picture that I got. And it's a lady with a braid in her hair. And she has flower, uh, origami. She's doing origami birds. And it's really pretty. I just thought it was just a really interesting, pretty picture. And this one is thirty-five. There's thirty-five colors in this one, and I definitely want to put that around these. Make sure I don't lose or get them mixed up with something else. Same company, same things inside. Little baggies too. Same things inside. And now here it is. You can see it. Again. Yay! You can go to Hobby Lobby and get them pre-made. Already made like that. The little marshmallow string with white or red uh uh, ribbon through them and you'll pay probably five dollars or more per garland so you can make your own anyways isn't she a beautiful girl lady 
doing her folding her little what are those stork swans birds origami birds and it's really pretty really interesting so the thing about aliexpress it's not the run of the mill same old same old stuff you see on puzzles the same images over and over again uh, they, they, you can get unique, unique stuff on AliExpress. I just like the fact that you have a little bit more choice, a little bit more difference. This is why I, had, I was able to get this from AliExpress, able to get this one from AliExpress, the cupcake one that you see on my intro. They're just different ones, the same old, same old stuff on Amazon. You get tired of and you want to you wanna branch out into different pictures, different choices of I'm going to go ahead and check if there's any problems with this. I don't think so. I usually don't have any problem with the cord glues. Now there are some wrinkles, impressions in it. But I don't think it's going to be enough to show through once your diamonds are on there. I just, I don't. I'm going to put that thing right there i'll be right back i'm going to check off every one of these per picture and then i'll let you know which ones if any were missing anything okay i am finished i have completed counting checking all of my diamond drills in each one of these each four of these this one was fine the little lady on the back of the bicycle it was fine. It had all of its drills. The lady with the braid and the origami birds, uh, it had a burst bag in it. Everything else was there. I've got to keep an eye on that 3033. I may, I'm going to check, see if I have any extras and I may put it in this bag. If I have any extras of them, if I don't, then I can go on Etsy and get them for just a few few dollars sent to me just to have on hand just in case there isn't enough if anything come out of shipping or whatever I didn't see anything fall out of the box per se but you know that it is what it is you do have those times where those packets do get uh, holes in them and most of the time this catches them and you're able to salvage them like I did uh, so that is that one um, this one had everything in it let's see it's the the seascape one with the, the the lady and the gentleman and the child it had everything in it this one um, it's missing number 645 drill 645 I may have some left they are round all of these are round except the lady on the bike that's a square one uh and it, it had everything so um i will check to see if i have 645 if i don't have 645 i can go online to etsy and get it i'll let them know that i don't have that i need five of those so they may send them i'll let you know if this company is good to stand behind their product and and see you can see where i write it at the top what's going on with this one so that way and I'll keep it out on my desk and it was the lady with the lantern at the creek at the river or whatever and I'll keep it out on my desk keep it in my mind to make sure that I go ahead and let them know that it was needing the 645 five packs of those what's happened is I, they probably was supposed to have a lot of times when you have to have five they'll put them in the big thick packs you've probably seen me see a couple of the big big huge packs the big huge packs have five in them each it's like 500 drills in them okay each little tiny packs ha have a hundred some of these I noticed ha didn't have as many in those packs but I'll keep an eye on them this is why I do not get rid of my extras 
from other pictures. I try to put them in there in case I need them. It is so, I mean, if you're going to do this like, like a lot of diamond painters that are seriously really into this hobby, you don't want to get rid of your, your, your drills because you may, you'll run into this. I mean, it's like riding a horse. You're eventually going to fall off. You have a bicycle. You're eventually going to fall. And you know, what's so crazy is people fall off a horse and won't get back on because they're scared to death. But they'll get back on their bicycle and fall off again and again and again. But yet they won't get back on the horse. Get back on that horse. Show him who's boss. Don't you let that horse bully you. <laughs> so... Anyways, all of these were in the, the little uh, Grogu was in there. So, <laughs> please tell me which one is your favorite of these. I, I know this is a long video um, uh, in depth because I just really fell in love with all these different pictures. These are the ones I bought. I have several more that I would like to get to add to this theme. But I have to, I have to pace myself. I've got, I've probably got enough diamond paintings for the next five years. So, I can't just go crazy. But I want to show y'all some of the things that I see. And it's so, so awesome. So, let me know which one of these are your favorite. And what you think about them. And then I will get back with you in a later video whether or not they stood behind their product, this company on AliExpress, and sent their diamonds that they owe me. Pretty much, I'm not going to be ill with them because for the majority, they sent extras. Like, um, in one of these, they were supposed to just send 15 packs of 154, and they sent me 16. And they every... I noticed I was writing down, every time you saw me writing down before I checked off, it's because they had sent one extra, one extra of all of those. So, um, it's a good company. I'm going to let them know. Five missing, five of this one number is just, they've just overlooked that. We'll get it. We'll get it. But five is serious because if I have, I might have six, four, five in my leftovers, but I might only have a hundred of them. And I'm needing 500. So, anyways, that it is what it is, and we'll we'll go with it. We'll work with it. I'm glad that you're watching. Thank you for subscribing to my channel and commenting. I really enjoy your comments. I really enjoy everyone telling me how they feel about these things, and and that uh, I'm so glad to be a part of your day. And if it helps you to have a good day, I'm so thankful. Thank you, Lord, for giving me the sweetest people on my channel and commenters. Thank you so much. Y'all are just a big part of my heart. So stick with me, youngins. Thank you so much, and God bless you.